Sources say that Dustin Poirier vs. Conor McGregor 3 is already in the making and nearly finalized. Dustin the Diamond Poirier has signed his contract for a showdown with Conor McGregor at the upcoming UFC event scheduled on July 10th. Multiple people with knowledge of the situation confirmed the news to MMA Fighting on Friday after Poirier inked his deal. ESPN reporter Ariel Helwani initially reported the news. We do have some breaking UFC news that I reported earlier today. So Dustin Poirier has officially signed his contract to fight Conor McGregor on July 10th at UFC 264. Again, Dustin Poirier has officially signed his contract to fight Conor McGregor on July 10th at UFC 264. This means that we are getting oh so close to seeing the trilogy become an official reality. At first, it was unclear if McGregor had actually inked his contract, but additional sources have confirmed that the Irish superstar had already agreed to the fight and the date for the trilogy with Poirier. Also, the Notorious recently tweeted about some facts in his fighting journey, making a reference to the upcoming trilogy fight. UFC President Dana White had previously stated that he wanted to book Poirier vs. McGregor 3 for this summer, hoping that the UFC starts holding events in crowd-filled arenas again. Well, when you have two guys that are in their position, you know, Dustin's the number one ranked guy in the world. You got Connor, who's uh, ranked number six, and they want the trilogy. You got to go with the trilogy. So we're probably going to try to put that fight together uh, this summer. McGregor will try to avenge a second-round knockout loss to Poirier at UFC 257. That score evened up the fight at one apiece, after McGregor dispatched Poirier by first-round TKO in 2014, when both fighters competed at featherweight. As for Poirier, he'll look for another significant win and a massive payday against McGregor. He reportedly chose the trilogy over a fight for the vacant UFC lightweight title in May. So Charles Oliveira and Michael Chandler will fight for the belt at UFC 262. What do you think for the two fighters going for a trilogy fight? Who do you think will win this time? Let us know in the comments section what you think. The risks of picking a fight with the strongest men in the world were put on full display last week when strongman Eddie Hall sent gymnast Niall Wilson flying through midair after absorbing a hard punch to the chest. That show of force, however, didn't deter another lopsided matchup from taking place this week, when UFC champion Dustin Poirier showed up for a sparring session with four-time World's Strongest Man Brian Shaw, which Shaw just posted to his YouTube channel. It doesn't take long for Poirier to establish himself as an elite athlete. In the first minutes of the video, the diamond is already putting on a lesson, literally teaching Shaw how to hit the heavy bag. After that, they move on to some pad work, with Shaw gleefully inviting Poirier to kick the pad as hard as he can. He barely budges. When Shaw returns the favor, you can see the shades of the Wilson Hall encounter with even Poirier flying backwards due to the sheer brute force of Shaw's strike. Finally, the two get down to business, practicing submission specifically, some side and back positions. And uh, see if I can keep you down, move around you, maybe submit you. Oh, but I did just see this guy lift the dumbbell that weighs as much as me, so. Thanks for watching this video to the end, and don't forget to smash that like button on your way out. Also, subscribe to this channel for more MMA news.